One common question that we get is about the uh, speaker distance calculations and the time alignment that Arcos does automatically. So let's take a look at that right now. The way to see that once you're all done with uh, all of the speakers to be calibrated is to come down here at the bottom and switch to classic UI. From classic UI I select delays and here's where I can see exactly uh, how much delay each speaker has been put in. What you see when I select uh, the display to show me feet, it's showing me uh, very large distances, 43 feet, 37 feet for the sides. Um, these are uh, probably much larger than the actual room. And the reason for this is that Argos is not calculating only the physical distance uh, or the acoustic distance, but also the included delay for each channel through all of the signal processing, including your surround sound processor and the digital EQ and any other processing you might have like wireless subwoofers. So you get a much more accurate uh, calculation of the, the true distances uh, from input to output. If I select uh, meters from the pull down I can see the same numbers in meters. Uh, if I select milliseconds I'll see the actual amount of milliseconds that Argos entered. In this case since the front left was uh, the furthest away, it added no delay. The center added uh, about two, uh, about a quarter of a millisecond, and the front right uh, slightly less than that even. So very small amounts of delay, uh, a few milliseconds on each speaker to align each of the outputs to the, uh, each other output.